In the wake of the Korean War, which came to an armistice in 1953, Osan Air Base emerged as a pivotal installation in the United States defense strategy in Asia. Located approximately 40 miles south of the South Korean capital, Seoul, the base has long served as an important cog in the wheel of American military operations in the region. The 1960s were a transformative period for Osan Air Base. As the United States deepened its military involvement in Vietnam, the base took on a more prominent role as a logistical center for operations in Southeast Asia. During this decade, Osan saw significant expansions and modernizations. New technologies were incorporated, and facilities were continually upgraded to meet the increasing demands of military operations. These enhancements not only facilitated the base's immediate tactical and strategic requirements but also laid the groundwork for Osan's enduring relevance in American military strategy. Life on the base during the 1960s was a study in contrasts. On one hand, service members found themselves caught in the whirlpool of geopolitical tensions and the looming specter of armed conflict. On the other hand, the base aimed to offer them a semblance of the lives they had left behind in the United States. Beyond its military infrastructure, Osan was a self-contained community complete with movie theaters, bowling alleys, and even a commissary stocked with familiar American brands. These amenities, designed to alleviate the homesickness and psychological stress inherent in military life, made the base a unique blend of the ordinary and the extraordinary. Within this environment, special events took on amplified significance. Among these were the shows organized by the United Service Organizations, more commonly known as the USO. The visit of American comedian Bob Hope to Osan was a memorable event of this kind. Though one of many entertainers to perform at the base, Bob Hope had a particular resonance for the American military community. His show was more than just a performance. It was an emotional respite, a brief diversion from the harsh realities of service life. Accompanied by an ensemble of musicians, dancers, and other performers, he transformed the mood of the base, even if only for a few hours, offering laughter and a taste of home. As the decades have rolled on, Osan Air Base has adapted to meet the shifting demands of American military strategy, but its core mission remains the same. It serves as a crucial outpost in a volatile region, a projection of American power, and a deterrent against aggression. Yet, it is also a home away from home for the thousands of American service members stationed there, then and now. In essence, Osan Air Base in the 1960s served as a microcosm of broader American military and cultural currents. Its history is a narrative woven from disparate but interconnected threads, the imperatives of Cold War geopolitics, the ordinary lives of its service members, and those exceptional moments, like Bob Hope's visit, that lifted spirits and epitomized the base's unique role as both a military installation and a community. Through it all, Osan endures, ever adapting, but steadfast in its mission.
Much obliged you hopped on board for this snazzy trip through American life in the 1940s and 1950s, all captured through nifty vintage photographs. If this flick's got your motor running, don't be a square. Click on that jolly bucket of bolts to subscribe to the channel for more top drawer content just like this.